Hey everyone, okay, so today I'm going out and I thought, well, I wanted to do a quick video for you all. Something, uh, anything to get uh, a video in. So, I'm going to go shopping, probably like grocery store shopping, and then maybe, maybe some clothes and some nail polish, I don't know yet. Uh, I have not posted any of uh, the favorite monthly videos or anything like that, uh, because I'm going to do a few other different videos this month. So anyway, uh, to begin, I've already applied a, um, a lotion, and it's the Shiseido right now. My dog is in here actually right now. Quit looking, no, no. And, um... But I'm going to be applying the Baby Skin Instant Pore Eraser. So I'm going to go ahead and apply some of that. And it's just the tiniest little bit. Probably not even half of a pea size. Okay. And I'm going to be using the Estee Lauder Double Wear Light. And the color is Intensity 2.0. And I'm just going to apply that on my hands as well. Because I'm not, I'm not trying to do a really fast or really slow video. Really detailed. I'm just going to warm it up in the hands. I'm kind of doing like a fast video, kind of like when you're in a rush. I'm going to go mainly right down the center again. Okay, if I can just quit talking. <laughs> okay, I'm going to be using the e.l.f. Uh, concealer. This is a two-sided concealer, and I believe it's in light. Yes, light. Okay, this does have a doe foot, so... I usually just apply it. Sometimes I'll apply a little few spots here and there. Okay. And then just rub that in. Real lightly. I know I'm using my middle finger, but come smooth that. And then I'm going to be setting that with my Studio uh, Mac, Studio Fix Mac. And NC20 is the color. Okay, and just a big fluffy brush. This one is a uh, from Claire's. I love it. It's big and poofy. And I'm just going to set to do the eyes. We'll go ahead and do the um, finish the face before we'll do the eyes. We're going to use the e.l.f. contour and uh, just the techniques. This is the flatter brush. I just love it for bronzer. It's, um, it's the uh, two uh, color. But I just love it. I just brush it. And if you need to, you can put a little bit on the back of your hand in case you have too much. Usually this blends really nice. Really nice. Just like that. Just like that. Okay. Next, uh, we're going to take some blush. We'll go ahead and do the blush right now. And um, I'm using the NARS Angelica. I use this all the time. I just love the pink. It's got some shimmer to it. It's just gorgeous. And just a big fluffy uh, makeup brush. I'm just hitting mainly the tops of the cheeks and bringing up just a little bit. Because I have a lot of a round face. So. Now let's see. To do the eyes, we're going to use a little bit of Urban Decay Primer Potion. And I'm going to try out the uh, silver in that Electra palette. Okay, I'm just going to rub it on both of my middle fingers. And just apply that on both of my eyelids. Okay, now I'm going to be applying the NYX uh, Jumbo Pencil Cottage Cheese. It's just this great, like, shimmery, um, sticky bra oh, sticky stick, I should say. Sticky product. Okay. Then, uh, we're going to try out the Electra palette that's silver because I'm wearing silver today. Oops. As you can see the silver there. And I'm just going to be taking a MAC uh, eyeshadow brush. Just simple. Quit Loki. Quit, quit, quit. He is licking the towel now that I just started wiping it. And I'm just going to... Oh, look how pretty that is. Wow. Pretty impressed. Really didn't expect it to be that pigmented. That is so awesome. Wow. Slightly blended up. Just a little bit, just like that. Oh, it's so pretty. Yay! Okay. And then if I have any fallout, which I really don't see any, I'm going to brush all that away. And I'm going to add a little bit of uh, highlighter right now because I'm thinking about it. And I kind of do that. Do you all kind of change up your 
Uh, this highlighter is Physician's Formula Highlighter Oops, in Translucent Pearl. And yeah, it's that color there. It's so pretty. I just think it's a great highlighter. A lot of times I'll do all the powder stuff first before I do my mascara. And you all don't always see that. Yeah, so just like that. And let's see, what else, what else, what else? Uh, we'll go ahead and do the eyeliner. And I'm going to go ahead and do my typical wing. The, the eyeliner I'm using is the smolder. I just always do smolder. Just like that. And then I'm going to go ahead and do the waterline. I love this color. It's so pretty. It's so pretty, so simple. Great out the door look. So pretty. Okay. Then, uh, let's see what else, what else. Um, I'm going to take a brush, just a small brush here, and I'm going to blend some of that. I'm going to have eyelash. I'm going to blend some of that up just a little bit here and there. Just to kind of feather that in just a little bit. And a little bit more on this side, just like that. Then I'm going to carry it down and blend out the corner there. The eye. And when you do things like this and you don't completely close up your eye, thicker on the ends and it opens up the eyes and just makes them bigger. Okay, then let's see, we're going to curl the eyelashes and add mascara. Of course, mascara, my favorite, I think. This is the Butterfly Mascara in Almost Black. Might be black brown. Oh, and I got some on my face. It's because I'm in a rush. Okay. And then we'll do the lips. Let's see. I'm going to be using the MAC Sublime Culture Lip Liner. I just purchased this again and I just can't help but love it. So I'm going to go ahead and use it. And it's just a crayon. Um, so you don't have to uh, shave it or anything like that. I love that. I'm just going to go on the outside of the lip. Just on the outside and fill it in just a little bit. My bottom lip is very, it's not very pigmented. So it's very pale on the edge. So I really have to fill that in. Okay, just like that. And then, and then we'll fill it in uh, with just a lip liner or lip gloss. Uh, this is the Naked Lip Gloss in Walk of Shame. And I've, I think I've worn this same lip look just the other day. I wear so much more lip gloss in the summer and in the spring. All right, so hopefully you all enjoyed this look. And I guess I could have done my eyebrows a little bit, but I think they look fine today. Okay, uh, let me know if you like this look and uh, look probably for a haul video coming very, very soon. And uh, maybe even a spring nail polish uh, phase video. And I will see you all later, bye.